Morning everybody, it's Toddy here. Got the Dash 2 with me. And just heading down to a wee beach. I'm on holiday so I always bring a detector with me. And I was panicking uh, in case I didn't get the Dash 2 before my holiday. Unfortunately, I never got my bone conducting headphones, which meant I couldn't use it diving. But I've enjoyed using it um, just at low tide. There you go, this is the beach I've been working. This was actually, you see how much it's dropped here? Yeah. This was actually a beach uh, full of sand on top of the rocks. You couldn't even see any rocks, it was just um, up to that level on the wall. But I've noticed it's starting to put the sand back on. Uh, definitely a lot less stones here. There used to be the stones further down. So I may have moved it to somewhere else, so we'll get a go. So how, how nice is that? See how we go. Put the DS on, so it was theirs. Ground balance, press start, pump. You notice it only goes to 80s. There's no way of manually um, adjusting this uh, email DXP. Um, so it'll, it doesn't go quiet when you're pumping it, um, it doesn't settle, it just stays. It's as if it's um, too conductive so maybe a wee bit different in diving mode but in beach and beach sensitive you still get a tone when you're lowering it but it seems stable enough and obviously I've kept uh, the headphones on because you can't actually hear with the waves this is the area that I was I found the chain in. Very stable, I've got sensitivity 95, salt sense 9, um, reactivity is just at 0.5. Could probably get away with zero. Now I've really really hammered this bit of the beach so targets will be few and far between I think Um, I'll change my tones, I've obviously not saved it last time, so um, we're going to menu, we go to disc, what oh, we buy it, disc, expert, right, you see it, and I'll put it to pitch, and we come out of that, and then we get to options, select, audio, and then we change PWM to square, there you go, and that's excellent sound oh cold feet oh. see very stable I'll turn the headphones off see if it see if we can get away with it oh, there's a chance I could miss faint targets Hear it? Very stable in the wet sand. Salt saturated, look. Very stable. Mm -hmm. 
no false signals. Very, very stable. Stable, no false signals. And it's on. Get the volume up a wee bit. Turn it up a wee bit. You see, nice and stable. A lot of magnetic stones here. That's the chirping you're getting. If you get a target with this on the beach and it's iffy, don't go with the meter, just dig it. If it targets it's coming in double zero, 95, 78, because it's on its limit. It could be lying next to uh, one of the magnetic stones, hear it? That's the magnetic stones. It's loaded with them up there like that. Plus... Plus I've got it pumped right up. See that's an iffy, right? It's 61 it's reading. We'll dig it, right, because we're getting a two weight. Dig it and see what comes up. Tried it, but see that? I was getting into stones there the other night, pure hard packed gravel. <laughs> there it is. So, there you go. I was right. I walked away for that too. See, I was right. So, that was an iffy target. So, I was right. So if it's an iffy, dig it. When I get back home to Scotland, we'll get some serious diving with this. Um, in salt water, not fresh water. Have a go with that. You can see, very stable in the soaking wet sand.
I can't believe how much sand's been put back in the beach, honestly. Um, loads. The hard pack there is, they must have put over a foot of sand in it in a day. Investigate any any iffy signals or any potential signal. A wee fish, see it? Never made it. Just gonna keep working this low area up to that wee marker there. See where the stones are? Definitely throwing stuff up. Yeah, that's 50s. This could be one of the wee annoying copper penny type things. They jump in all over the place. Maybe that's another target, let me see. No, it is. It is. Don't you see it? Annoying, they've got iron in them. Pain in the bum. Loads of them. But I just dig them anyway. Dig everything. No, just keep it rolling. I don't care if I get targets or no. Um, Woohoo! I was in there diving the other week. Just getting through a bit like a look at that. Oh that's what's, that's what's ripping the beach up. Listen to this. Can I get near it? Look at this, this is low tide. Can I get near it? This is how it's settled in. That's the way you want it, nice and smooth. Look at it. Pretty there waves. Definitely a lot quieter.
a fé. Here, there you go. Coin, see, very happy signal. It's deep. Just a, get a, if you get a two way signal at all, even one way, one way, and then one, two, dig it. Because that, they waves are actually throwing stuff up onto the beach. That's how these stones are there. It's lifting them and just throwing them up. So it could really throw anything up. You don't always need to get down to the bottom. It could lift stuff and just throw it up. Churns it up out there and throws it up here. See it? Churning it all up, look. Look at that. Woo. So today. It's a funny wee looking back there, see it? As if it's... Mm, looks a bit different. Let's try this bit. It's nearer the stones maybe. Give you a shout if I got a signal. Probably a coin. 80s. Yep. 
100 euro. Here's like a minute 86. Oh. 87s, probably a euro. Coins, yeah. They look like rings, don't they? Bloody annoying. Euro. I've just been working up and down, up and down. Um, so you see, it's just throwing stuff up and dragging stuff off the sand, taking it in. See, I've just been working up and down there, see it? A few targets. Um, I'll take this, turn this off so as you can hear it. Hold on. Near a half. Ay, ay, ay. Right. Here we go. Turn it back up again. Uh, we'll put it into beach sensitive. That's ah, one tone, hear it? Sorry, two tones. Nice and clear, see it? Because we're only dry. Right, uh, back to. That's beach. Bit more footery on beach, right? And that's beach sensitive. Right, we'll dig it on beach sense, right? So it was more sensitive to the egg types of coins, which is absolutely bang on because I dug loads of them in beach sensitive. They've got iron in them. They're just coated. So what we'll do is we'll run it in beach sensitive. Right. See how it goes. It's harder to hear somebody going in for a wee swim, maybe. Another one of the wee coins, I think. You know, minus and then a positive. It loves him. See, loves them. Beach sensitive. Loves them. Well, there's. I'm going to change the tones because I hate the that just flat tone. It's too uh, flat for me. So, um, menu expert. Bang it up to the pitch, and it should be bear. I'll leave it on the sensitive now, right? Here it is a bit more chirpy. Let's see what I've got my sit settings at, right? The scrim, right? Bang that down to nothing. We don't really need the scrim. Right, bang it down. Sensitivity 95, salt sense 9, frequency shift, iron volume, turn that off, right? 
um, reactivity, stick it up to your bar now. Waves. Thirties. I'm hitting the stones here. Oh, the stones. Yeah, that, that was thirties. And another one of the wee coppers. See, loves them. I've not dug any coppers all day to beach sand stuff. So it shows you the higher frequencies picking up the lower conductors. No, we're digging anything. Anything, because we're right in the zone here. So I'm going to dig anything. This is a target. It's a coin, I seen a coin. You see, that was iffy, really iffy signal. There you go, another copper, see? Beach sensitive. Look at that. Oh, ho, ho. wet feet. Oof. Love if they just switched off for a wee bit, let me into this good bit. That's now stable as. Out a wee bit, should be right on low tide now. Very stable, eh? Smooth, not a chip. Yeah, some wee stones it's picking up. Big magnetic stones underneath, big giant rocks.
See, don't you worry about filling the holes in. The sea does it for you. I've got my headphones on, very faint. Wet feet. Oh! <laughs> Oof! It's getting a wee bit warm on the. Look at that, look! See the salt's made it a better target, see that, the salt water? Oh, right in the gravel here, feel it. That's where you want to be, stones. Is it a stone maybe? Because I've got it set really high. Yeah. Ah, it's probably that. There we go. Get a couple of dig it out. See if it comes out. Ugh. Shite. Ah, if it was there, it's away. Away. Chirpy. If I was working in the water, I would definitely lower the salt sensitivity. This is a very sensitive mode, beach sense. So, see what I mean? Woohoo! Right in here. So, what we can do is. Drop to beach sense to seven. But what I don't want to do is, when I get up there onto the dry bit, I don't want to lose any de depth or sensitivity to wee stuff. But in my testing, um, you didn't lose much depth dropping the sensitivity, the salt sense. Just a wee bit. See, it's very stable. Just bang it up, leave it on it, and then when I get down to the surf, I'll just drop it. If you're working near the surf and you've got wireless headphones on, you really need to watch this. Um, see if that pops off and drops in the water, it's away. The waves will just take it. It if it's it. We'll dig it anyway. It's a two way, it's iffy. 
It's an among the stones to get it dug out. <laughs> See? Could be a coin line on its side, it could be anything. There it's there. One of the wee coins, yeah. They're a pain, but we to dig them. Go, so we'll put menu salt sense drop to the seven. There you go, nice and stable. See that? Can hardly even hear it with the waves. That's how I put the headphones on this morning. Just leave it, it comes out. Just wait, just you just wait, be patient. Go away in a minute. Give me a wee minute to get in. There's no use doing it anyway because what happens is I lift the scoop and the water going out rips it right out the scoop. So One of the wee coins against it. Pains! You see, and that was in the soaking wet sand, and they're a really hard target. Look at this. Strong enough to snap the coil lugs, honestly. It's that strong when it pulls on the, the machine. Right, so salt sense, bang it back up. Hear it chirping. Now that we're working up, just drop it. That's a euro. There you go. Fifty cents. Daddy's on the board.
Dig it anyway, if I dig anything if I, there you go, that's me into the stones, that's me into hard stuff, that's what we're wanting, hard stuff, feel it grit, that's a good bit, with the old stuff in it, hear that, now you seen that was an iffy target, there you go, bit of metal, but it was iffy. See, this is what we're into. Look at that, the gravel. Oh, the good gear. That's where the old stuff is. That's where the rings are. There you go, it's iffy here. It, because it's it's in me, all the, the grit and stones. There you go. Still in there. Yep. Something there. Yeah, just leave it. This is a good bit of the beach. See here? I just wish the waves would go away. Let me into the mine. Something there. Cold feet. No, nope, still in there. See what I mean? Kind of get near it. These waves. Relentless. Not relentless. Never stop. Right on the good bit of the beach. This one. Every machine I've used on the beach. Um, even PIs, signal on stones, certain stones. It's just the name of the game. Usually comes in as a high conductor. I've had it with every multi frequency I've used, even pulse induction. So don't be horrified. 72. That's usually a ring pull or a ring. It comes in there, but I've had. I can't really tell wherever it comes in. Um, so don't be horrified if you dig. 
couple of stones. That's just the name of the game for beaches. Oh. There you go, coin. Oh, it's a 20 pence. <laughs> 20 pence. One of the AVI iron copper jobs. That's what that is. Yeah, there you go. See, a new one. It's throwing stuff up, or it's pulling stuff off of that beach, dragging it down here. Not really bothering, as long as it drags a wee ring or something down, I'd be happy. Not one gold ring in this holiday because of that. That's ruined it. It's been like that. I don't know what's going on with the sea. It's never like that here. Been coming here for two, over 10 years. And I've always had gold rings. But I don't know what's going on here with this. Look at that. Every beach is the same. High waves. Something going on with the weather. None of the diving shops can get diving because it. There you go, it's 74, 60s, 70s. <laughs> Fell in the hole. Another copper. Wash the coil. Best feeling getting up early in the morning hitting the beach. Here are the jet skis coming out, ready to start their work. You notice I've got the water kit on it. You don't need that if you're just doing up this end of the beach. As long as you're not submerging the coil, you're fine. But you will find, if you've not got the water kit and you, the water runs over the coil, you don't get a signal. It cuts the signal out. So, if you're going to be wading in and out, the low tide mark into the water, you need the water kit. Very easy to fit, just clips on at the bottom, wrap it round, wrap the elastic band around the bottom and wrap it all the way up and stick it in the top there, see it? The day isn't complicated, honestly. As I say, once I get home, I'll get into it more, I didn't have time because I just got to it the day before my holiday. And a lot of people will try and complicate it to make themselves look clever. The DACE is a very simple uh, detector, so is every other detector. So, don't think that you can't buy one because you're no longer in the hobby. Uh, another wee copper see um, don't think you can't buy one because you're just in the hobby because it's it sounds really complicated on videos it's no very very uh, capable machine there's plenty of preset programs in there for you to use and all you need to do is just adjust the sensitivity that's it and select the tones that suit you. That's it. There you go. 
go out here. I'm not even getting a reading look. I know I'm just getting a reading 13, but we're digging it because I dig every two way target. There you go, I'm into the stones there. Right, so if you lose it, I'm in the, right in the stones here. That's what you want, stones. Yeah, 80s, so I'm reckoning that's a, a euro. Right, right in the stone. You seen that wasn't even given a reading. There you go, another one of the AB coins. Swines! That was deep, eh? Right down in the stones. It wasn't even given a reading. And it shows you the days goes deep on the beach. You imagine that was a high conducting silver or a thicker gold ring. This machine would have blasted on that, no problem. I actually buried a gold ring, that gold ring, on a string to 15 inches in the wet, soaking wet sand with water in it, and it got it, no probs. I actually lifted it up about five inches, so it could get it 20 inches, no prob. So, as you see, dig. Iffy targets in the beach, very iffy. Even if it doesn't read on the meter, dig it. As soon as you get a two way air on it, dig it. As I was about to say, the day is that you can make it complicated if you want, but it's very simple. Discrimination cut out iron, sensitivity in the 90s, set it at 90, nice and stable, in general mode and away you go, don't worry about it, set your tones, whether it's two tones, whatever, just set it at pitch like I've got it here and away you go, put square tones on and you don't need to change a thing. The biggest problem that people come up with, what they do is, they try and change it. They watch all the YouTube videos, people getting machines, finding a couple of coins and then naming their program, all these fancy names. And then they try and put it in the machine. And that's what, you're not learning your machine, you're not learning the functions, what each function does. And that's what you're supposed to learn what every function does then you know what to change when to change it another coin 80s There we go, coin. See my gold ring comes in at 73. Very light. Swing this thing all day.
No. Wet feet. Ooh. Sun coming out. Don't get this before the waves come. Did <sighs> come? Oh, come on, get out. I'm gonna get soaked here, look at this. Oh. Oh. Still in the hole but it looks it. Just keep the coil on it. I actually feel it, look it's pulling the machine right out of my hand. Whoa. Look at this. Beautiful isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Look, woo -hoo -hoo. Just waiting a wee break. And it's getting higher, it's up to my knees. This looks like a wee reprieve. There you go. Look, it's actually <laughs> sinking. See if it's still there. Forties. So it's probably one of the wee shitty coins again. You seen that was absolute oh look you couldn't make that up. Oh it's not even a ring either, is it? Oh I don't know what it is, I'm not sure if it's a ring. It's a ring of some sort, I don't know if it's what kind of ring it is. What have we got here? My first ring, I don't even know if it is a ring. The first ring shaped decent thing. Ah, it's definitely a ring. Oof, imagine it was a platinum job. I don't know, but I don't like to look at this. See this? But it could just be marks off the sand. Stuck to it. Don't let it look at it. It's cleaned off right enough. No glasses, I'm waiting Nicola coming down. She's got better eyesight than me. Well, it looks like a ring. Is it a ring? For the days? It's reading low 40s. So it's no reading up where the gold should be. It's no reading up where the silver should be. Platinum reads low. I know that because I had to find one for a guy once. Platinum. So 
try to see if it says P anywhere or Platt. Oh, there's a mark on it. Definitely a mark there. I think. I went my daughter coming down. Looks like a ring anyway. Anyway, here's hoping. Right in that surf line, did you see that? I nearly never got it. I nearly never got it.